welcome to Bot Box. We are 93 episodes in and this is a special moment, the Bot Box. You'll see what that is in a bit, but first we're going to talk about expulsion entered by Brentwood School, it's a school project, and the Series 9 debutante. It was originally a grey boxy robot with a curved front end and engine that could protect the internals. It had a uh, flame baton on as well as the school's logo of course and most importantly a horizontal spinner whose blades only emerged when spinning up when they got to 400 rpm. This version however was slow and could get stuck on its side. It found home in Series 9 Heat C, where it faced Lifter Foxic, Ring Spinner, Mr. Speed Squared, and Heavy Metal. Expulsion ended up crossing paths with Foxic first, as Lifter attacked Expulsion right after opening the pit. Mr. Speed Squared got a hit in next, before Heavy Metal sent Expulsion over to Sir Killalot and the Spikes. Where Foxic attacked again. Mr. Speed Squared also attacked and Expulsion were KO'd, unable to get out of the spikes. Then Mr. Speed Squared hit them a few more times, but the fight ended not long afterwards. Expulsion went out along with Foxic after the lifter had an argument with the floor flipper. Expulsion returned for series 10, but in a completely different form, which I will now describe. It was more compact, being closer to a pyramid shape, could run on two sides and roll over if it landed on a wheel side. Its weapon was now interchangeable. But all weapons couldn't expand on spinning up like the original expulsion. If expulsion landed on its weapon, it could use the gyro forces to self right This got me praying for the floor because in series 9 there was a robot that could self right using a spinning weapon and it had torn up the arena dance floor. And by the time expulsion's heat aired, it, had, be, it had, uh, had its heat and the floor flipper had taken a pounding. Expulsion had found home in Heat E where it faced Crusher Coyote and the Axe Hammer of Thor. Expulsion also came along with a friend, a mini pop called Detention, of course. It was also predicted to come third in Heat by me. As soon as the fight started, Coyote went straight for expulsion, grabbing the bot in its jaws and sending it straight to dead metal, which got expulsion stuck. Detention ended up stuck on the flame pit and dead metal put expulsion there too, the flame pit that is, where they stayed for the rest of the fight pretty much. Then Metal did free detention when it got sent rogue, and Thor and Coyote did avenge Expulsion's honour, but Expulsion was sent to Robot Redemption, uh, where they faced front hinged flipper push to exit. Now, it's been a while since I talked about Robot to Redemption, and the last time I did that, a uh, beer cake got mangled. Anyone remember the cakes? This time, but things were different. Well, there was trash talk, and the expulsion team joined in with the skeleton voice saying, Robot ears, stand by. Sorry, I can't do skeleton voices. Expulsion had to dodge dead metal again, which they did, and drove around trying to get a hit on Push to Exit. It ended up on Push to Exit's flipper. Which was broken. So Expulsion escaped, got a few hits on the now dying push to exit, pushed him over to near the floor flipper, but 
drew over the floor flipper themselves and got flipped onto the one side where the jail forces and their design could not help them. But since expulsion could move, because it could spin on its axis, and push to exit could not, they were through dramatic tears from the push to exit team. The judges got called in and they went for expulsion. Their reward? A fight against deadly drum spinner Magnetar. They were advised to avoid the floor flipper by Dara. The first thing Expulsion did was to unleash the Frog of War, which just gave Magnetar time to spin up. So as soon as the Frog cleared, Magnetar sent Expulsion flying. They landed on the floor flipper, which flipped Expulsion over and they landed on its weapon dead. Once Expulsion was counted out, the pit was opened and dead metal dumped them in it. Georgina seemed to find this funny. Oh, you gotta go out in style. Hang on, they went out. You see, next was the playoff fight for a place in the 10 Robot Rumble. Standing in their way, Coyote. This time, Expulsion had new bars to keep them stable. Expulsion got a good couple of hits in on Coyote, but also hit the wall. They escaped before Coyote got a good bite in, uh, but Coyote, however, was apparently um, dead. So Expulsion just drove around the arena, dodging Matilda. Oh, and they came too close to her. Coyote came back to life, though, and shoved Expulsion halfway across the arena, where Coyote really did die. Then Expulsion drove over to Matilda and got flipped over, but Expulsion could still just about move enough to get into the Ten Robot Rumble. I haven't talked about the Ten Robot Rumble before. Let's do this! Which is the special thing I was talking about earlier. Before I go on, who called Expulsion coming third in the heat? Yay! Yay! GT was a good heat for my predictions. So, along with expulsion in the fight was Thor, another axe bossing terror hits, three flippers, Apollo, Iron or Six, and Eruption, two drum spinners, Concussion and Sabretooth, Big Nipper, which brought pincers to the party, and Tracked uh, Traction, a fellow school pet. Ahead of the battle, Expulsion was decorated to look just like the arena floor. Camouflage! Now nobody will be able to see them! Expulsion was sadly out of focus early on, until after Thor opened the pit. Then, whilst the eruption, Expulsion was driving around the arena, looking for a what to fight, they drove straight in. They got plenty of company in there, with every single robot, bar terahertz and eruption, joining them. Eruption ultimately won the battle. I'll let that be a lesson. Don't paint your robot arena floor grey. I prefer the second version of Expulsion to the first. But I wish they could have done better and shown us what they were capable of, especially with the driving. It's harder than it looks. The idea behind it, though, was a good one. So, who's next? It's... Dreadnought. <laughs> Until next week, Callison two four four out. <laughs>